Welcome to mind body. You need dumbbells or soup cans. Today I have almond breeze and a set of 10 pound dumbbells. I'm probably going to use these more. The 10 pounds are going to be too heavy for most of the moves. And then we have a face cloth for a slider and a mat. Reach across. Reach up. Big shoulder roll. Add the arms, pull them back. Swim one arm back at a time. Kick the legs back. Add a squat if you want. Let's kick it out front. Reach for the foot. You don't have to touch it though. Let's tap it to the back. Sweep it down and up. Way up on your toes. Reach for the sky. March or jog. Arms up, pull it down. Rotate the arms. Take them front and back. Jumping jacks with or without a hop. Left knee up, tap back. Little boxer shuffle here, punch it out to the front. Right knee up, tap back. Boxer shuffle, punched up high. Let's bring those elbows up. Side to side, with or without a hop.
wide stance down and up. Four, three, two, one, march. Nice job, big shoulder roll. We're gonna start with a back exercise. So, knees slightly bent, tipping forward at the hip, shoulders are back. Your reverse fly, squeezing up and down. Let's give that a try to start. Take it up and down. Or at your own pace, breathing out on the lift. You don't have to go with the music. Keep it strong, controlled. We're gonna add on to this. Take your right leg back, lift it up, down. Find that balance, breathe out on the lift. Little break, we're gonna change legs. I'm changing dumbbells, you don't have to though. Here we go, take it up, down, other legs turn. Four more right here. Four, three, two, one. Little twist. Nice job. All right, staying with the back. We're gonna keep those elbows in tight this time, going for a row and down. Elbows staying really close to the sides. Knees bent, shoulders back. Let's start with just the row. Ready? Here we go. Take it up, dip. Up, dip. We're going to add on to this move. You're going to tap one leg back at a time. Very steady. Four more here. Four. Three. Two, one, twist. Release that low back. We're gonna try that one more time. Setting up for your row, ready? Here we go, take it back. Squeezing those shoulder blades together. Breathing out on every lift. Four, three, two, one. Nice job. Grab a quick drink if you'd like. We're going to grab that face cloth or slider. So let's put that on the right foot to start. You're gonna bring your arms up 90 degrees. Taking them out and in. Now have a look if you had dumbbells. 
You're not hanging down. Wrists are stacked nice and straight. Let's give it a try. Starting with just the arms, take it out, in. Remember, it doesn't have to go to the music here. Now, that foot with the slider on it is going out to the side and back in. Not necessarily at the same time as the arms. Let's add on again. This time the legs going a little further, going down, two, up, two. Arms are going at a different speed. Most of your weight is in the heel of that standing leg. One more slide. Shake out those arms. Changing legs. Starting with just the arms again. Ready? Here we go, take them out and in. Out, in. Or at your own pace. Let's add on the leg. We're not going low yet. Take it side, center. Lower. Take it out, two, in, two. Arms are still going. Out and in. Out and in. Two more slides. Nice job, shake it off. We have another shoulder exercise coming up. So let's take the right arm. It's gonna pump up and down. The left arm at the same time is gonna go to the front and to the side. Ready for this? Strong stance, here we go. Front and side. Keep breathing through it. Shake it off, we're gonna change sides. Big shoulder roll. Relax that neck. Left arms turn. Ready? Here we go, one to the front. One to the side. Keeping that beat with the left arm. Trying to anyway. <laughs> Remember, you can do it weight free anytime. These get heavy in a hurry. Two, 
One, shake it off. Woo. Next, we're going into some biceps. So one arm, the right arm, is going to reach to the front like you're passing somebody something. And back in. The left arm is going to do a regular curl and then a hammer curl, switching back and forth. Take a second. Feet hip distance apart, knees slightly bent, shoulders up, back and down, core is strong. Set it up. Ready? Let's try this. So the arm going front and back is going pretty slow. The arm doing the curl can go a little faster. If you mix it up, keep going, that's a part of it. Last one, shake it off. Roll the shoulders, we're changing sides. Left arm is gonna pass out to the front. Right arm, one hammer curl, one regular curl. Ready? Here we go. I'm breathing out every time I pass that left arm forward. side's always easier. This side's figured out a rhythm to it. It's not as bad. How are you guys feeling out there? Even if it's confusing, keep on going. Four, three, two, one, shake it off. Nice job. Now, right arm out to the side, back in. Try and keep it at about 90 degrees. Left arm in and out. Almost to straight. Keeping that little bend there when you're ready. They don't have to go at the same speed. Now we're gonna complicate things further, obviously. That left arm is gonna go out. Give me two pulses. Then do that curl again. We're trying to keep that right arm smooth and not stop while those pulses are going on. <laughs> are you pulsing the right arm too? Try not to. I am. <laughs> 
Try that twice more. Shake. Nice job. Starting with left arm out and in, right arm out to the side. Ready? Here we go. Nice and smooth to start. Now focus on your left arm for a moment. We're going to try to keep that exactly as it is. Right arm's going to add those two pulses when it's extended out long. <laughs> try not to pulse that left arm. It wants to so bad. Working the biceps, working the brain. We got this. Last time. Nice job, shake it off. We're gonna set up our mat. So you will need your slider. You will need your dumbbells. The slider is gonna go on one heel. So we're setting up a bridge. You're gonna be sliding one foot out and in. Pick a foot, any foot. With the dumbbells, we're gonna start with a fly. So elbows slightly bent, coming out to the side, squeezing up, squeezing through the chest, like you're giving somebody a big hug. Let's take the hips up, setting up. Ready? Here we go. So the arms are gonna go slower than the legs. At least they're going to try to go slower than the leg. We're going at two different paces. I'm breathing out every time my arms come up to the top. Slow arms. Slightly faster leg. Four, three, two, one, mini break, changing heels. Get ready, come up into your bridge, arms up, leg is fast, arms are slow, let's go. Now, if you can find the beat to the music with that leg, it makes it a little bit easier. Breathing out as the arms come up. Four, three, two, one. Great job. All right, we're switching it up a little bit. You don't need the slider. 
we're going to go into triceps. So I'm going to opt for one of my dumbbells. It's 10 pounds. It's going to go to the forehead and back up. Skull crusher. Elbows squeezing in tight. Like you're holding a basketball between your elbows. Or you could use two dumbbells. Put them together to the forehead and up, whatever you choose. Let's start with just the skull crusher. Take it down, two, up, two, slow and steady. Now we know that can't be it. This is too easy alone. Well, not easy. Easy on the head alone, we'll say. At the same time, let's check this part out while we stop the arms for a moment. Your legs are going to go up into a bridge, knees out to the side, back in and down. So, up, out, in, down. Up, out, in, down. Ready to put those together? Slowly to the forehead, slowly up. <laughs> Do your best with it. Little break. That one's tough. Breathe, take a moment. We're going to try that one again. So let's practice just the legs first. Up, out, in, down. Up, out, in, down. Now I like to try to keep the leg part to the music. Arms are going slow. When you're ready, add in those arms. In theory, they stay to the music. Nice work. We're going to take two dumbbells next. Elbows are in tight to your sides. Like you're punching the ceiling, arms are going to go straight up over the shoulders, then back down by your sides. Up and down, controlled, having a good time. Let's start with just that. Here we go. Breathing out on the lift. Now, as you've guessed, that's not the only thing. Options for the legs. We're going to get a little core action in on this. So they start at 90 degrees, tapping one down and up, tapping the other down and up. Make sure that movement is coming from your hip. You're not bending your knee down to tap it closer. Reach a little bit with that heel. Tap it a little bit further away. Ready? Let's give this a try. Here we go. Spine is in neutral, meaning there's a little space between your low back and the mat. 
You're maintaining that neutral spine, the low back's not moving up and down. I'm breathing out every time I raise those dumbbells up. Changing the legs a little bit. They're going into an alternating tap. again starting with the single leg tap down take a deep breath reset the arms slowly up and down starting the legs at 90 degrees one down and back up breathing out as you reach those dumbbells up check in with your spine we have a neutral back. It's happy, it's having a good time. Switch up those legs. Try not to rock through the body, keep breathing. to all fours next. Probably going with a lighter dumbbell. So on all fours, the right arm is going to come up to your side, then reach out long to the front. Up and out. Your left leg is going to extend back long. It's going to come up and over the other foot, and then up and over. Like it's making a rainbow. You're squeezing your glutes on the way up and over. And at the same time, core is steady, strong, holding your balance. Let's start with just the leg. Here we go, take it up and over. When you're ready, add in that arm, up, and reach out to the front.
trying to breathe out when you're reaching that arm to the front. Four, three, two, one. Nice job. Changing legs. Changing arms. Let's start with that leg again. Right legs turn to go up and over. Up, over, up and back. Squeezing your glutes. Find your balance. When you're ready, get that arm started. Up to the side, out to the front. bit different. So that left leg's turn again. Flat foot facing up to the ceiling. We're going to pulse that leg up, squeezing the glutes. At the same time, your right arm is going to come out to the side, find your balance, and back to center. Now you could have a dumbbell in that hand if you want, you don't have to. Ready? Here we go. Leg is going pretty quickly. Squeezing the glutes on each pulse. Arm is trying to stay slow and steady. Four, three, two, one, nice job, we're changing sides. Right leg's turn. Bend the leg, pulsing up like your heel is giving the ceiling a high five. When you're ready, take the other arm out and in. Find that balance. Everybody, we're gonna go into the cool down. 
We're going to cross the right leg over, give it a big hug, then sit up as tall as you can. Let's slow down that breathing. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Changing sides. Hug it in as tight as you can, sit up as tall as you can. Let it go. Let's bring both feet in. Place them together, gently pressing down on your knees as you bring your belly button towards your thighs. Flat back coming forward. Bring both feet out wide. Walking the fingertips out to the front, relax your neck. Keep those deep breaths. Walk back up slowly. I'm gonna cross my legs, but you can sit however's comfortable for you. We're just gonna take one arm across, sitting up tall. Keep turning towards the wall behind you. Look back as far as you can, sit up as tall as you can and breathe deep. Let it go, changing sides. Back to center, let's roll the head side to side slow. Come back up, big shoulder roll. Come on up to standing. Slow twist, letting go of any tension in the low back. Plant your feet, find your balance, take one leg up or point back, lean back whatever one you prefer.
changing sides. The other leg is up or back, pushing that hip out to the front and breathe. Let it go, let's sweep the arms back in front. Take one arm across and hold. Change sides. Take that same arm up. We're going to push the elbow down. And change arms. Let it go, big shoulder roll. Let's sweep it low, sweep it up, give yourselves a hand. Great job, everybody. We challenged the mind, we worked the full body. I hope that helps bring some focus to your day. Have an awesome day.